Hello and welcome to Thursday. Um, today is a not quite so interesting day. Uh, however, it is the penultimate day of my current job. Um, we'll get to that in just a second. One thing I wanted to mention is that today I'm using the um, pistol grip that I bought a few months back. Um, I haven't really been using it just because it's a bit unwieldy and if I'm out in the wild at uh, somebody's house or just um, outside of my house with this camera. Um, carrying around the pistol grip doesn't really make too much sense. It's like, it's hard to, I guess, hold, like the, the strap goes on my shoulder, camera sits at my side. Having the extra grip is a bit awkward and unwieldy, so don't really use it too much and I leave it off because uh, the way I set it down onto uh, my computer when I'm offloading footage, it doesn't really make sense to um, keep it on there all the time. So um, today I just wanted to use it and uh, you see how well it uh, affects me holding it and it's much better than um, what uh, than just holding the camera itself. Okay, um, so that's where we're... <laughs> that was a tangent. Um, yeah, so I didn't really end up cleaning the um, bookshelf area today. I uh, barely got working on the um, clothes. But uh, I did end up cutting down. So those are the only pants I'm keeping. I'm going to go hang those up um, in a bit. Those pants, these sweatpants, and then I need to go through the shirts um, before trying to uh, see what I'm going to get rid of. I can probably find a place for the shirts. Uh, and I'll need to go through all of my drawers to, um, actually find a place for them, but, uh, I think I can manage. Um, so that's good. Uh, I know I have a, what is it, eye doctor appointment on Saturday, so I'm going to hold on to the contact lens stuff that's in that corner of the room, hopefully. Let's see if I can... That stuff in that corner. Um, yeah, that's nine, maybe ten years worth of uh, contact lens stuff. I know one of them is date postmarked nine years ago, so that's fun. Um, yeah, I was not great with my contacts, but oh well. Um, Notable things that happened today, I worked out a bit, and I'm feeling the... <laughs> when people say no pain, no gain, I'm feeling the like the slight muscle ache, which is a good sign because what they mean by no pain, no gain is that uh, it's you're, you're ripping your actual muscles, you're damaging them in order for them to heal and grow stronger. So that's what's... Uh, been going on with that. Um, one thing my mom mentioned when I was telling her what I was doing with all these jeans is that um, she's like, what if you put on more weight? I'm like, that's not the plan. Thinking, <laughs> I thought to myself, but uh, yeah, that's for sure not the plan. Plan to keep this off, and even so, um, most of those pants that I wear currently fit me when I was uh, 20 pounds heavier, so that's the plan. Um, funny enough, I don't think I can hit, uh, what is it, like, the ultimate goal, ultimate, ultimate goal would be to hit 120, but, um, I don't think that's the plan. I think it's probably going to be closer to 130, 135, even if, maybe even what I'm currently am, it's just a uh, weight kind of redistribution and, um, replacing fat with muscle. And because muscle weighs more than fat, it's going to be interesting to um, to see how that affects my body and how much I'll ultimately end up waiting. Weight is not the final um, end-all goal, but it's a nice marker to go by, you know? Because I've been stagnating at 140 for a year and a half almost now. And... Well, that's a good weight for me, I think. 
it's a healthy BMI, but everybody everybody says BMI isn't the end all be all. Um, even though it's healthy, it's uh, not um, not where I want to be. Uh, if I put on more muscle, I'll end up weighing more. That's a different story. But um, yeah, I've decided that I am um, kind of abandoned the whole. Uh, ignoring carbs thing and um, avoiding them. Um, I've <laughs> I've learned to um, just enjoy food for the time being because uh, I believe I told myself Sunday, either Sunday or Monday, I will be committing a hundred percent of my efforts to uh, dieting well into eating well, into working out, and I will be spending the bulk of my time with that. At least a couple hours a day. I can actually manage to um, afford f like three to four hours of just straight working out. And what's, what is that? That's going to be the either the 13th or 14th? So I'm going to give myself a month from then and see how that goes. Um, yeah, I'm excited but also nervous. I've never really worked out this much. Even like now, it's like an hour a day. I've never done that much. Uh, back when I was a kid, I used to do karate for an hour, maybe twice to three times a week. And that wasn't really enough time. Uh, and I think back in high school, I was like, the lowest I weighed was 120, and that, that's why my ultimate goal is that. Um, there's that, and there's also, what was it, for a couple months in 2017, 20, late 2017, I did go to the gym with my cousins, and, um, we did three hours for two days a week think something like that either two or three days a week and it was like an hour running and then the rest was just um full full body we usually did like um above torso arms and legs split it up by days something like that but uh yeah i'm committing to full body every day for a month that's a horrible idea but it's the plan at the moment. Uh, we have, that's gonna happen. Uh, and we also need to mention that um, tomorrow is the last day of my current job. Touched on it briefly a bit, but um, yeah, it's been a not too bad week. Granted, it's only been a four day week and <laughs> it's not even that, it's only day three. But, um, tomorrow's day four, tomorrow's the final day. And it's weird. Like, if it's like this all the time, even though, like, I feel fed up, there wasn't a lot of work this week, I'm just at, kind of at my limit. And I've, ex I've accepted and, like, that it's my last day. And it feels bittersweet, because I want to keep working. Like, if I worked from home just indefinitely, that'd be good but um yeah it's i'm tired of dealing with clients and management because they are horrible at getting back to me and jesus christ i got an email from a client our worst client to be fair but who uh i think literally in the email in parentheses had insert employee name here for the email and i'm like what is happening but yeah tomorrow is gonna be my last day and um i guess i'll speak my piece on that tomorrow <sighs> tomorrow at five o'clock only a few hours until then so i think that's what i'm gonna call it here for tonight thank you all for watching i hope to see you tomorrow and until then later <laughs>